Hi, thank you for purchasing the subvideo um, Google Form. This is the directions on how to use it, and I'm going to click right here to get to the form. Okay, so I have clicked on the link. It's up there. And the first thing, if you do not have a Google account, you need a Google account um, to use Google Forms, and it's just going to ask you to sign in. And then it's going to say, would you like to make a copy? And you're going to click yes so that you can get to the resource. And here's, um, here's the resource, the music sub videos. Um, I have all the questions here, but you can edit them any way that you want to. Um, the way I've set it up is that they are all multiple choice so that you can, um, it can be self graded. And so I'll show you about self-grading. I'm going to click over here where it says settings. And these are the general settings. I usually limit it to one response. But you can change any of the settings and explore those. On presentation, you can show the progress bar. It has 20 questions. So you can um, put that on. You don't want to shuffle the question order for um, this resource. Um, each set of questions go with each video. And then if you go over here to quizzes, um, make this a quiz, I automatically have it set there um, so that it allows auto grading. Then um, you can decide that you want to um, let the students see their grade right away and if they missed which question and what the correct answer was and the points value or you can click it so that they don't see any of those things. Okay, so your students have used the Google form and they filled it out. And um, I've required that um, each question be answered before they're allowed to submit it. So they must answer the questions. But you can also change that. So now I'm going to go up to responses and I'm going to see how they did. I can look at a summary of the entire class and see how they did on individual questions. Or I can, um, I can look at the individual, like if I need to put it in the grade book. So if I go to John Doe, was my first student, and I can see he has 18 out of 20. I can scroll down and see exactly which ones he missed. However, if I have 55 people in my choir and I was sick yesterday, I can just move on to the next one. So then I can see that Jenny Davidson, she got 20 out of 20. I can see that Justin Bieber, oh, he had problems. He got 9 out of 20. So um, it's set up right now for self-grading. If you want to download the responses, you can download the responses in um, a spreadsheet, and um, you can actually see when the students filled it out at what time. So I hope that this is a helpful resource to you. There's one more quick thing that I wanted to show you. If you haven't used Google Drive, um, Right here, if you click on the square of squares and you click in Google Drive, you'll see the resource that you just bought right in there. So um, if I click on copy of music sub video, I want to use it again, um, and I want to see the responses. If I click right there, um, there are your responses. So you didn't lose them if you close out of it. It's in your Google Drive. Thanks.